ENC Sports First is brought to you by 76 Circle K. Hoffa Day sports fans, here we are back again for another round on PNC Sports First. I'm Leo Payumo. It is Tuesday, so we have another fast episode for you today. But let's turn now to the Guam Men's Basketball League. Three games played on Sunday afternoon at the University of Guam Cowboy Fieldhouse. This would be day four of the season. The first game featured the KFC Bombers and the UOG Tritons. Let's go to the hardwood. The Bombers setting up. Billy Belger in the corner for the Bombers hits Riam Trahan for a 10-foot jumper. Sweet. Trey wasn't done yet. Here he goes off. A Bombers steal. Off to the races. Another two points. But wait, there's one more. Another steal. That's right, coming up. And it's going to be another layup. Same guy. It's Trey. But UOG answers back. Mark Canovas with a baseline jumper for two points right there. Next. Jorge Piolo for Yoji would slash right down the middle. Take a look at right here, hitting glass. Nice. And Desmond Fikes would jump in on the action for Yoji. He gets the feet for, from Piolo up next, right here at the top of the key. A jumper, two points, not a three. Desmond, nice shot. And But the Bombers would go on and win by a score of 97-68. Legend Glover with 24 points for KFC. Ryan Nagata led the Tritons with 13 points. In the second game, the Mitsubishi Outlanders handed the two-time defending champion Chief Berries their first loss, 79-75. James Collins with 25 points for the Outlanders. And in the last game, the MVP Stars defeated the Auto Spot Phoenix, 93-62. JP Cruz, MVP, 29 points. And now it's time for another fast episode right here on PNC Sports First. Brought to you. Hi, my name is Jada Uggen and I play third base for the John F. Kennedy Islanders softball team. Describe yourself in three words. Three words I would have to say energetic, athletic, and ambitious. Who's your favorite sport personality? I would have to say my dad. Yeah. He played baseball, football. He wrestled a little bit. He did a lot of sports. What do you like about the sport that you're playing? Third base, there's like a lot of action in field and I love to be a part of the infield meeting and the chemistry between all of us, you know. Name the top person that gave you advice in the sport that you're playing now. My dad, hands down, my dad. How do you prepare yourself before a game? During the day, I try to not think about it as much as a lot of other athletes do. Um, I try to remain positive because I feel like that will go into the game later on. Name a player or a team that you perform well against. I think I play really good against Sanchez and Academy. Do you have a second sport? I play multiple sports. Before softball, I tried out wrestling, and now that the season's over, I'm paddling. What's your least favorite thing about being in sports? It's gonna be getting dark. <laughs> what do you do in the off season? I like to read. <laughs> what is your advice to up and coming athletes? You just be yourself on the field and don't take all the comments that other people give you very seriously. Pancakes, purple, Bruno Mars, Lips of an Angel by Hinder, Apple, Southpaw, the boxing movie, Ryan Gosling, Micro Trip, Jeans and a T-shirt, My Parents, 
the beach. Fast is brought to you by 76 Circle K and Bank of Hawaii. Welcome to tomorrow. And once again, we'd like to thank our sponsors for the, the Fast episode, 76 Circle K and Bank of Hawaii. Welcome to tomorrow. And that's going to do it for sports on this Tuesday. For PNC Sports First, I'm Leo Playmo. Enjoy the rest of your Tuesday. PNC Sports First is brought to you by 76 Circle K.